So a little bit patron warrior for hopefully what is the final push for its legend. And I got a donation from Alex for five euro. Thank, thank you very much. It's much appreciated. Uh, he says, "Servus aus Augsburg," which basically means "Hello from Augsburg," which is a German city in Bavaria. Thanks, Alex. Um, this might be a keep for like coin deaths by turn three, and then play this turn five four. But I would rather have Fiery War Eggs, I guess, so let's see if we can find that somewhere. Doesn't, doesn't seem to be the case for now. <clears throat> Might be Handlock then. Definitely have to see, save the coin. Handlock would be hard. Okay. Because no war song, no frothing. No execute so far. That doesn't seem to be the case, so doesn't matter too much. I'll just play this to like protect myself from a little bit of damage so far. Parallel woman? No. I kinda had to do that. <laughs> hmm. I could actually save the coin. I mean, I kind of want to play these together, so saving the coin would make somewhat sense. Just Taskmaster this. Or I play Acolyte, which means that a second attack buff would one-shot this, but that's not the point, right? It's not. No, that's not bad. It's more on curve also, and if he has a second abusive or I don't know what, like an implosion, then the whirlwind will kill this. And or the spiderlings if he like power worms here or something. Might force him to do an awkward trade. Two, 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 two. Yes! <laughs> Sometimes lucky. Oh, that's pretty good. Is it? No, it's not really good. Uh, if he plays Argus, though, it's like two, two, twos. I can kill one of them. Kind of want to play the. Uh, well, I cannot even play this in Battle Rage, so it doesn't really matter. Uh, I should have done this first, but. Probably won't change my opinion anyways. Blood and blood. This should be good enough against Argus. Only problem is like Flame Imp Argus now. Or hit Argus, hit... no. That's all fine. That's good enough. Power sand though. <laughs> wow, if I had a war X uh, a war song. It might be worth going for it. I could also draw a lot more cards. Huh. This this is the crucial turn I feel like. I think I go for the safe way. Which is drawing a bunch of cards. Uh, seven. Drawing seven cards. Drawing three cards. Three cards. Plus I'm not sure if this. If I had to get rid of a card. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Would have been nine with coin. Ten. No, it would have been exactly okay, but. I didn't want to risk something. Put this apple on your head. From the void, oh, that's good for me. Oh, that's almost insanely good for me. Um. I have an execute for whatever comes out of this. That's pretty good. I have this whirlwind here. Yeah, I think it's pretty much. Oh, yes, with this one, it's definitely Thorson. <laughs> I can make a board full of patrons now. Oh. And the executors for zero mana, which is also quite good. Ah, you should have eaten both. Do I have double world one? No, I have just one. Double would have been awesome. Okay, let's see. I can six. Well, that's a bunch of stuff, right? I should just go for it. And innkeeper. Well, even if he would have eaten both with the what caller, uh, Terra, I could have simply executed it. And went for like double inner rage, whirlwind, full board of patrons. It's one of the few matchups where you can actually, where I think I can actually keep the patron. Around, maybe even Gnomish. No, I think I want weapons more. This one could be considerable though. Could go for like this curve and pop his shield and minibot stuff. Could also be good for a battle rage. Okay, let's try this. I haven't actually tried this. Um, might be worth it. It's also better against an aggro paladin that I like lost yesterday against with the with the rogue. <laughs> the two aggro paladins actually. It's pretty good against leper gnomes. It's not that good against Chaos though. Hmm. Hmm, okay, keeping the the armorsmith seems really silly now. And I want to coin our death spite kinda. I'll just play it, I think. Um, just to like contest this for a second. I don't want to use the coin here because I want to develop the patrons. Especially if I... Wow, okay. Well, I'll have to whirlwind this. So... Oh, second one, that's good. Might be worth... Coining out Death Spite, but then I'm not doing anything else. And like next turn, I could hit a second time and play Frothing, I guess. Or I can use Whirlwind next turn after this died. Coining out Petr. Uh, uh, no, next turn I'll play Death Spite, I guess. So, but hmm, okay, whatever. Strike. <laughs> Maybe place Argus, and I'll probably have to whirlwind. 
This ties to a true server, that's basically the problem. Reporting for duty. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, puts it into BGH range. But I actually have a BGH target, so that's not too much of a problem, I think. It's a little bit wasted, but it. Ooh. Actually, I'll just whirlwind. So I don't waste my weapon charge and I can, like, develop the patron next turn. Um, didn't really work out with. Yeah, well, it kind of worked out with the armor smith. Hmm. It depends. Oh, sorry, there's a BJH. And there is this guy. Well, this comes around in time. So I have two healthy patrons. Okay. Two healthy patrons, probably not. Hopefully not. So he would need an equality and to get rid of... No, yeah. No, he needs equality. That's what he needs. Belcher isn't good enough. Especially because I can do this. I don't even have to use anything else. Um, question is, do I want to use Warsong? Puts 3 damage on the board. No, puts 9 damage on the board? Doesn't matter. It might matter. Uh, I have 3 patrons, I have 6 patrons, so Warsong would fit very well into that. Okay. I'll just go for the quick win here because I cannot really win anyone else, I feel like. Like, if he clears the board, I cannot really win anyways. Because I don't have bell rages or card draw so far. But it, no, what I didn't account for was if he uses Consecration now, I have like three one health patrons. Whoops. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. This was stupid. I shouldn't have played the War Song. Yeah. And he knows it. Whoops. Mistakes. Everyone, everyone, everyone in, in, in. It's still nine damage though. Well, make it 15. Uh, 12 so far. And I have two executes, so if you just place Tyrion now, he's dead. Uh, if you place second consecration, he needs a 4 mana town, so maybe Cockhammer? Yeah, it was still okay, I guess. Because I got so much damage in. This was like my initial support, anyways. Oh no! That's not fair. So he heals up to 7 the next turn. Uh, so if he plays Tyrion or Lay on Hands or... Mm. <laughs> mm. It's a little bit risky against Harrison. Maybe I shouldn't have done this. The two executes are clogging up my hand, that's a little bit sad. Put this apple on your head. Okay. Ah, oh, he has a heal bot. Where's my Grum? Reporting for duty. Mm. Die to my own mistakes, probably. If I don't get a war song, what the hell? Wow! These draws! Okay, I need exactly, I don't know. Would I would have needed exactly Grum plus Activator, but. Uh, okay. <sighs> wow. 
Okay. I would have just needed to make like one or two spaces on the board to win this game. Maybe not playing the war song. Yeah. Nah, nah, nah. nah, nah. Mistakes, mistakes. Garrosh versus Rexa. Let the hunt begin. Victory or death. Oh, I guess that's a hand that I can keep. Especially because he just got rid of one card. Like, of course I'm looking for War Axe, but that's kind of a War Axe. Can probably rush him with frothing a little bit. Okay, I'll just have to somewhat play on curve, I feel like. I'm not sure what to do with the mid scientist though. I'll show, uh, I'll show them all. Okay. Mind if I roll me. To my side. I have to get rid of this. Okay, it seems to be mid-range hunter, which means this is a freezing trap, which means I have to be a little bit more patient. It probably means I'll just play these two guys. Yeah, in this particular order. If it's explosive, it's not even that bad. But it probably won't be. I'll get you armor if he plays something like Belcher. No, he top decks a bow because he has a trap up, right? Why wouldn't he? Huh. This makes for two healthy patrons. One of them dies here. Probably still good enough. Strike. Two frothings can be really good in racing. These two are quite good against the hyenas if he plays high main now. But he might get rid of no. Well, it depends. It's it's not obvious. And it's one before he could play something like unleash Helmaster. So he would need like an abusive sergeant. Oh, that's interesting. Not to say aggressive. Just doing nothing now? This would be interesting. It's 8, 11, 14, 10, 6. Okay, it's a little bit less. Okay. It's like the most aggressive way he could have come up with that. Wow. If I had a war song come in, I would have won, right? Yeah. With this and the war song, it's definitely a win. Um, I think I play Armorsmith and then I go for the big board. So, I mean, he knows that I have it, but I might not have accounted for it. Might also pass up on some damage. I mean, this is a patron, that's a patron, that's a patron. It's three, it's six, so I have to get rid of this one also. Yeah, I think it's too soon to play the Whirlwind. I would really like to play this, though, because on this board, these things are insane. But I'm a little bit afraid of something like... Okay, he's seven mana, so he plays a Web Spinner, he plays Kill Command, a Quick Shot. No double Kill Command. Ten. Thirteen. Actually, if I just do it this way, it should be quite fine. Hmm. <laughs> 
So that's five. If he has double quick shot, it's like at another six, it's eleven. Uh, another unleash is seven, twelve. Oh, whoa! What? Quick shot. Nine, twelve. I didn't account for Leroy Jenkins, but I think he's still dead. I mean, he's 11 damage showing, so... Huh. Well... well yeah. Regardless of the trap, it was lethal. 